this year, today, oh dear, what's the day it is? <laughs> what I wanted to just talk about this at time, at time, well, how the human mass at time is unbelievable. They are very quickly to just uh, uh, add your sense new uh, situation and move on ahead. And they doesn't the humans uh, need that much uh, to spend and uh, to think about uh, what they did so much. They can always uh, go to the new things. And, and compared to me, myself, I'm always uh, stuck in some uh, moments and some uh, situation. And, and that's make myself a little bit more not that good at you see the things. And that all to other people's things just go there and there and move. It's crazy how the daily routines the people are so good at managing to getting so many things to done in some uh, such of the small amount of the piece of time. Oh uh, really? Yes, that's the good thing to know about. And well, we know that there are so many things they could imagine. Uh, let's suppose uh, the human space exploration. Well, in the 50 year ago, uh, there was a chest and just a test as a new, the first time the human and the Soviet Union uh, sent to the Sputnik and the first time that they heard Arvis. So before that the human race never did anything. It just was uh, 50 years ago. But 50 years it just was uh, 400,000 hours ago. 400,000 hours? Is that not a long time? I mean, it's not. I will just see. 200,000 times some lunch in that time. Or I just can easily sleep over at a small amount of time. So the time really is a quick. I mean, and then the human just only in the 10 years we reached the to the moon. The first the human and the earth 1961 and the 1969 and the first time to the moon. Space. After that, humans did it that much, so they went to new places. Actually, humans had to stay in the Earth orbit until then. And it's quite funny that uh, there has not been a lot, much of the human interest in the outer, outer space. They, they found the new uh, troubles there. The space was very uh, this place where the human couldn't just uh, survive a maneuver there. And there were no say oxygen. What's uh, the most important thing is also they lack at any kind of resource that will the human support, like the natural, the liquid waste, for example, or that there are also a lack at so much of the important things. And there were uh, no the foods or the place to be. In the moon, it's uh, just one that uh, used to deserve. even the Sahara or an Antarctica in the Earth are more uh, the favorable place to the light than in the anywhere in place in the moon. Perhaps they can say that, that in the moon uh, you can uh, just however uh, just set some uh, space if we just uh, create, even though there is no atmosphere in the moon or at least it's uh, only one of the 100,000 about the Earth the moon still have a, uh, some kind of a resource. If because of this resource is using and changing, it just can be sometimes to be fed into some uh, settlement there. Um, and where first uh, there is a lot of places, even in the solar system, with our. Uh, after all, if the human have a technology to changing, a uh, Venus is a hot planet. It's have a more atmosphere than the Earth have, and it's uh, the most perhaps the best place. In the first glance, actually, it changed because it's uh, very close to the sun, and it's the sun always will uh, quarantine enough inertia there. And there is also a mess in its atmosphere, what the human can use to be full. And, and if the humans uh, can somehow the create machine which can the harvest and the methane and then to transfer it, for example, to water, uh, then the, it will be. Actually, with the very uh, giving the very good this cats to give in the the human code the Mars and exploration there and landing there and chasing uh, to the surface to the humans uh, population and perhaps it's going to happen. Perhaps I am not having any time schedules. I mean, there is uh, no to explore. In now, China have very much to come uh, outside of the USA, Soviet Union, or the European Union of this space uh, flight technologies. And so, because the Earth is a very, very uh, treat and risk place to be only and the settlement of the human population and their humanity, it will be uh, important in the future towards the, in the, what is the time uh, to the explore all of the other places and to go to human 
space and a little bit their repopulation and they are colonizing a lot of new areas. What do we know about the external life? We haven't know any evidence. At least I don't have any evidences of any. Uh, I have never uh, seen anything in a real life with my own senses. Perhaps I would have to be that much on the space or other things, but. All these UFOs and other things, extra uh, aliens and uh, extraterrestrial uh, characters and uh, creatures, uh, I have not, never detected them. What is it? If the solar system is a very hostile place uh, outside of the Earth, of course, on the carbon organisms, which are based on this uh, basic acid, the DNA chromosomes, so that seems to be at last in the system. Perhaps there have a been a moment when the Mars might be have uh, some kind of form of life or some asteroid. And what I think about the life itself, they say it's very hard to create and life with uh, some uh, basic uh, chemistry without any kind of. Th and they have uh, always uh, created to life with for the. I think so. It's over quite easy to the basic block event to create if you have a uh, the right material and you know how to create it. The life itself, they ask, and who, what is the creator who made the life? I think so that the life itself uh, just uh, had the ability to, to get in flourish because there were, uh, to the chemistry was itself the life form, what is the life? There is no extra power needed, only the basic uh, energy arter and then the chemistry molecules. What is the molecules, of course, uh, had a uh, time, there was uh, so many a place in the example Earth where they have a chance to the up uh, take and to uprising and the, and the ability to, to, to make it this civilization. Civilization have over been over two billions. It goes through huge time. So remember that the humans can just create in the couple of the times in some laboratory with to just combine some basic amino acid and to just. And it happens a miracle. Everything has a reason. And uh, even the light basic forms, they are very small, and humans just can just uh, mix through different chemicals. And I hope some happens because these chemicals have to be exact form that they go to the big end of the, some uh, light process. That's the one when it's a light process of basing of the, the most uh, simplest amino acid and they are need phosphate and they get some better future. Differ to the most uh, simplest virus even. Human have not uh, created. So the human will be see how the life has created when human could create from uh, to the basic elements and to some uh, basic virus. But human have not created ever and even to the most and nevertheless the even to the Simple cells from nothing, only the taste knowledge. So that means that once human will be funded, they will be see how the life have created after all. It's nothing mystical. There is no need to utter a superpower or almighty power creator of those life forms. They are just as anything. There has ability to happen it, and there is a reason. There is a consequence, and that's. What is important to know that everything what is going to happen in the physics and to Earth universe theories always have a hard after that those happen. It's not uh, simply anything need to be purposed and mean it, the human frame capacity to understand the things the basic things are such too simple to give in his any quantity and a credit. Of course the human kid could accredit that there looking for a lot of things, but kind of to keep a good credit that they have a just accomplished uh, to really to get the real and really understand at the fullest level of the everything. So the human are just very uh, early stage. We are still at very early age stage of everything. After all, I will say human are when we have at uh, different stages, a level when the human advancement are major events. Until the human are the exploring of the day, have uh, absolutely every human uh, are absolutely more immortals, and of course uh, every human have a superior power. So there is no way a courts or any other things are going to kill any people, so any sanities, any viruses. That's the first step, of course, towards them to have a superior knowledge, a power and control between any uh, other human beings. And the whole other system are just needed, to, of course, uh, exploring and, and to expand into space. And that's the second step. 
and when they go to harvest, the, they, they, could the human ever actually harvest energy to the most uh, fullest form? We have the material, and we know that the energy is everything. So everything material actually is the same. Of course, it is different. What's going to happen? Level it is changing and varies, but it is still every single material mass. It's matter, energy. We can uh, transform it. It's pure energy. But the, the human still have very un. Uh, critical to and uh, to this energy system to do it to transfer. So it's of course our task. If you want, uh, if you want an example to create a cult from a waiter, we need to know how to be uh, this a weak words of the taking of the quantum physics and to tell that we need to do something energy. We have LHC, a large hard 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 Sorry, my voice is and my spelling. Anyway, I will come back soon.